What is up guys, Mr. The Reverts here and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to change your PSN ID as of today, April 2019. Now Sony did came up publicly with a blog post on April the 10th stating that users can now change their PSN IDs for essentially as many times as you want. And I'm going to have the gameplay in the background of the video so you can see what I'm doing here. And all you have to do is go over to the settings, press account management, account information, and then profile. And then once you're here in the profile, look for online ID. After that, enter in your new PSN ID and then you're set. Just make sure you confirm after you are finished. And yeah, very, very simple, guys. Like I said, you can essentially change your name as many times as you want. The first name change is going to be free of charge. However, after the second and future attempts, it's going to cost you $5 if you are a PSN Plus member, um, $10 if you are not. Now, one issue that Sony has stated publicly that's going around are games not updating the name change. I'm going to have a list of those games down below in the description if you want to check those out. Um, but pretty much these games are the games that came out before April 2018. These are the games that might be experiencing these, this issue. Um, not all of them have, have this, but just some might occur, so do keep that in mind. But I'm pretty sure later on down the line, there's going to be a fix for that. Also, there's reported issues with potential risks, including losing progress in certain games. Some games may not function properly, and you might even lose content, even paid for content for certain games. Um, so do keep that in mind if you're planning on changing your name. I'll have a link down below for a FAQ Sony has put up regarding the online ID change feature if you want to check that out as well. But yeah, this has been a highly requested feature for a very, very long time now. And Sony has finally delivered. I am just a little bit worried that there are going to be issues from a, a lot of people saying that they're having issues with older games. But if I were you, I would hold off on updating the name until a little bit later on down the line if a fix comes out for those games. The reason why this is happening to older games though is because they were not developed to support the online ID change feature. So again, just keep all of this in mind if you're playing any older video game. And so yeah, please tell me your thoughts about this down below in the comments, guys. Also drop a like on the video if you guys did enjoy. And thank you for watching. Until next time, I'll see you later.